Hello, dear friends. Welcome to my page, SA Vibes. In a surprising turn of events, Nelson Chamisa, the leader of the Citizens Coalition for Change CCC Party in Zimbabwe, has announced his departure from the opposition party. Citing the increasingly hostile political landscape in Zimbabwe, Chamisa, a prominent figure in Zimbabwean politics, expressed deep concern over the state of affairs in the country, highlighting the mass exodus of its citizens due to various socio-political challenges. Addressing the media, Chamisa emphasized his unwavering commitment to Zimbabwe and its people, vowing to continue his efforts to advocate for positive change within the nation. Despite stepping down from his leadership role within the CCC party, Chamisa affirmed that his focus remains squarely on saving Zimbabwe and honoring the aspiration of its citizens. This development comes at a critical juncture for Zimbabweans as it grapples with persistent political instability and economic hardship in the country. Chamisa's departure from CCC is a signal and, of course, a significant shift in the country's opposition landscape and raises questions about the future direction of political movements striving for change. And, of course, so many people saw him as one of the up leaders who could lead Zimbabwe to another step of development in the country and of course he bases his point that elections in the country were rigged and that is why he and his party did not win the presidential elections. And of course, after calling on the international bodies to look into the matter, up till now, he saw no response so far that could push Emerson Nangangwa off his ways and have decided to step down. And right now, so many people are in the dark in Zimbabwe with so many questions. Many people are thinking that he has been threatened to the point of stepping down. Meanwhile, other people are applauding the fact that he has gone down because they say he didn't have that power, that ability to rule the nation if at all he was made the president. But however, many people still wanted him to be the president of the country and he advocated for the second election to take place and of course that then happened. So many people at the level of the CCC party right now are in tears because they believe that someone they were counting on has just betrayed them. It is a very very hard time to so many many people because right now people just feel that Chamisa has seen that he can never win this battle and has decided to give up and the question that is still in the minds of so many Zimbabwe Babians is the fact that where will he go right now? Will he join the ruling party or he would remain as a person who is just advocating as he has said that he will be advocating for the right of the people of Zimbabwe. So this is something that is really on the platforms right now and so many people are changing their ideas concerning all of these the questions are just so numerous as many speculations are all over the space so ladies and gentlemen i just want you to go to the comment section and tell me what you think about all of this that is going on in zimbabwe